this video, we're going to talk about using So Katoa, which contrary to popular belief, is not an ancient rain chant. If you remember this mnemonic device, you should have no trouble remembering the definitions of the trigonometric functions sine, cosine, and tangent, which the ACT will test you on. We use this melodious acronym to find missing sides or angles of a right triangle. So is an abbreviation for sine of theta, which is the Greek letter used for angle equals opposite over hypotenuse. Ka stands for cosine of theta equals adjacent over hypotenuse, and Toa reminds us that tangent of theta equals opposite over adjacent. Let's use this acronym to write equations for the sine, cosine, and tangent of a given triangle. Starting with so, the sine of A equals the opposite over the hypotenuse. In this right triangle, the measure of the side opposite A is 2, and the hypotenuse, the side opposite the right angle, is 5, so the sine of A would be 2 fifths. We've figured out our sine. Now let's set up an equation for the cosine of A. Cosine of A is the side adjacent to angle A over the hypotenuse. The adjacent side is the square root of 21, and the hypotenuse is 5, so the cosine of A would be the square root of 21 over 5. The tangent of A equals the side opposite A, which is 2, over the side adjacent to A, the square root of 21. So the tangent of A is 2 over the square root of 21. Now that you've got the basics, let's solve an ACT problem that involves Sokotoa. In the following figure, what is the value of cosine x? The answer choices represent the cosine of x. We'll circle the angle x in the drawing and write Sokotoa next to the triangle so we don't forget it. The cosine of x is adjacent over hypotenuse. b is adjacent to angle x, and a is the hypotenuse. So the answer is b over a, which is choice a. Great job. You deserve a treat. These types of sine, cosine, and tangent problems are pretty straightforward on the ACT. They may move the triangles around to try to disorient you, but if you circle the angle in question, remember your Sokotoa, and check to make sure you're working with a right triangle, you should be able to outsmart them.